Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be talking about MMA fighter Fallon Fox, a transgender male fighting with the women. And my question to you is, do you think that that is a fair fight? Regardless of the transition, regardless of the surgeries uh, that she's had to become a woman, regardless of all that, you still have the DNA of a man. Nothing they can do can change that. They can change the exterior, but they can't exchange what you are. You're still a man. You still have those dense bone structures. You still have different hip structure than a woman. You have a better leverage advantage over women. So how in the world are they letting a transgender man beat up women? It's... I don't care what anybody say, and, and I'm not homophobic or nothing like that. I mean, let everybody do what they do. But a man fighting a woman, no matter what he's changed himself to look like, is still an unfair advantage that he has over these women. And he's pretty much destroying these women because it's a man. Is a man fighting women. You can take a mediocre man that really don't know much about MMA fighting and put him in a ring with one of the best female MMA fighters in the world. And that mediocre man of the same weight would destroy that woman simply because he has an unfair advantage in his body structure. If you got denser bones than a woman do, better hip displacement as far as balance is concerned, as leverage on that woman, when you hit her, the punch is a whole lot greater than that of a woman. If you look at, you see that fist right there? That's a, that's a man fist. No kind of surgery in the world can change the size of that fist. If I hit you with that, you're going to know you've been hit by a man. No matter what the exterior look like, that's a man fist. This is something I just, I'm going to let y'all, if y'all decide to say anything about it, uh, let y'all talk about it in the comments. But as far as my thoughts on the whole process, it's, it's ridiculous to be putting transgender people in the ring with women. It's, 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 it's ridiculous because the thing about it is it's always going to be an unfair advantage. I don't care what they do to themselves. You can't change your DNA, you're going to always be, always have the DNA of a man. So, that's what I wanted to talk to y'all about. Hit the thumbs up button. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. And again, I'll be talking to you later.